Now, our correspondent, Olu Phillips, is live in the Lekki area of Lagos. Let's go to him now. Olu, what fresh information can you tell us now? IJ, what started some days ago as a peaceful protest, peaceful young people marching through the streets and making their voices heard, has turned into a Black Tuesday here at the Lekki um, Toll Plaza which is just a hundred meters away from me. Now, this place used to be well lit by the street lights. Remember that we spoke live here from this spot at 5 p.m. telling the whole world that these people are still peaceful, sitting on the floor and telling the whole world that they want their government to listen to them. And after that time, just a few hours after that time, when it came into darkness, um, the street lights went off and some folks approached uh, in uniform and open fire i'm going to i'm going to speak to one or two persons who um were very close to some of the firing range and what they have to say my brother please can you come tell us what exactly happened speak up we were protesting peacefully after a uh, comedian ay approached us he addressed us there was nothing we are still uh, protesting peacefully without any violence at all immediately the light the street lights they went off People started shooting at us. We were, we were able to recognize them. They were putting on uniform. These were the military men, yes. the soldiers. Yes. They, they, we were lying down, waving our flag, no, telling them they are protesting peacefully. But yet, they refused. Yes. They were shooting directly at us. It wasn't to, to drive us away, it was to kill us. Okay, I'm, go I'm gonna let him stop there. I'm gonna bring someone else, IJ. This is live update and all our equipment are away. We had to make, imp um, uh, we had to improvise these systems. You can see, I have some, you can see, but I have a lot of folks, friends here in front of me, those who are protesting and they're pointing their torch lights, uh, phone lights on me to be able to illuminate this place. Look at this man, for instance. He's conveyed a few people to the hospital and he's got blood stains all over him. I'm going to ask him to step out again. I'm bringing someone else again. Look at this man. This is part of the damages that are happening here at the Lekki Toll. Now, IJ, if you think that is not good enough, IJ, look at this. Take a look at this. Take a look at this. Take a look at this. That's bullets. This is it. Bullets. These are evidences that people were shot. Earlier, I sent, we saw some pictures that we sent in of someone who was shot on the tie. Two people have been taken to a hospital that we are aware of, but there are more than nine persons are receiving treatment in various hospitals across this place. This is what is happening here at Lekki Toll. Um, I have just a few minutes or a few seconds to leave this place because we are now under a guarded area by some of these guys. And they assured me that I couldn't do this for more than um, three to four minutes. So, IJ, the world, uh, Channels TV, uh, I mean, we are speaking live from the Lekki Toll Plaza. Allow us to leave now for safety because the military men are still around here. It's, it's back to you, IJ. Thank you, Olu. Whatever you do out there, do stay safe and, uh, and keep us updated as much as you can while staying safe while you do that. Thanks a lot for that.